Hey YouTube, Wendell Lee Well Services back at you uh, for another video today. Uh, there's all kind of videos uh, out there on well tanks, uh, well tank sizing, how to size a tank, uh, how to charge a well tank, what to do with a well tank. Um, so just kind of wanted to uh, give you the the customer, the uh, video watcher, the self installer, uh, whatever you want to call it. Um, just just three tips to consider uh, when a having your well tank uh, sized by somebody or B if you're gonna uh, install a well tank yourself um, number one most uh, critical factor I consider uh, when uh, putting a well tank in this is uh, ear ear regardless of size is location of the pressure switch and so you'll probably notice if you've uh, had a pressure tank installed by a well driller or a well driller is coming out to your property to, to install a tank, um, they have these tank tees um, pretty much right next to the tank. Uh, you can see it's pretty simple setup, got everything plumbed up, but you're probably wondering why they do that. Number one most critical thing is to have this pressure switch located as close as possible to the tank. Um, can't tell you how many times I've gone out to a job site where um, somebody has uh, installed a tank and has the tank up under the house and has the switch outside at the well. Um, in that situation uh, you may as well not even have a tank installed at all. Uh, this pressure switch uh, doesn't even know the tank's there. It, uh, cause uh, what's referred to as bouncing of the pressure switch which is your pump cutting on and off real fast whenever you use a lot of water uh, number one thing to ruin your well pump so number one thing to know when you're installing or, or having a tank installed or sizing a tank have this pressure switch as close as you can to it um, I get if you don't want to have one of these tank tees um, where you can have the switch right at the outlet uh, try to keep it within five feet or less of the of the switch tip number one tip number two is know what you're purchasing um you know we have different tanks here you probably see this size here 44 gallon um does that mean that you have 44 gallons available of use before your pump cuts on uh, absolutely not uh there's two terms referred to in the well drilling industry for uh, pressure tanks one is the total volume of the tank and one is the drawdown volume of the tank total volume is pretty self-explanatory it's this number listed on the box that's the actual volume of the tank itself that that tank can hold but drawdown uh, capacity of the tank is the number that you the customer are concerned about whether you are getting a tank installed or whether you whether you are installing a tank yourself drawdown capacity is the actual capacity that your tank has before your pump cuts on meaning how much water do you run before your pump cycles on and I'll do a separate video on that later uh, that's highly dependent upon um, what what your pressure switch setting is at um, Antrol and Flexcon and everybody out there, they have uh, charts out there that show this. Um, let's just take this one at the bottom. I don't know if you can see it, but there's one column here for total volume. And then depending on your pressure switch setting, um, it's going to determine what your drawdown volume is. So for example, a 119 gallon tank with a pressure switch setting of 4060, meaning the pump cuts on at 40, cuts off at 60 has a drawdown capacity of 35 gallons okay meaning you're gonna run 35 gallons before your pump cuts on this is ultimately going to determine how much your pump cycles and is also going to determine uh, how long your pump lasts a pump cycling too rap too rapidly is the number one cause of pump failure okay and then number three is the use of more than one tank um, we have a lot of different places uh, where we we or the customer wants to get a, a desired drawdown um, 
for for a particular pump and we just don't have the room to put the tank in uh, you can see tanks are made in all shapes and sizes uh, a lot of locations we have to put tanks uh, up under the house and there's a, a limited amount of space available so just keep in mind if you're if you're looking for let's just say you needed one 44 gallon tank which is going to give you about oh uh, let's see just so where i don't confuse anybody 40 gallon tank at 4060 is going to give you about 13 gallons of drawdown so let's say you want a 44 gallon tank but you don't have the room to install it you can install two or three 20 gallon tanks in lieu of that uh, two two 20 gallon tanks would give you about 10 gallons of drawdown with a 40 60 setting um three 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 20 gallon tanks would give you about 15 or so gallons so just keep that in mind um again it all comes down to a a, a call standpoint and a spatial standpoint um do you have the room and is it practical to put three or four tanks in 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 lieu of one tank um you know ultimately that's going to be up to you the customer uh and the a well contractor uh, that's in that's installing your tank for you um, they're going to be able to give you the best uh recommendation but again if you're using two tanks just remember and refer back to tip number one and that is the tanks have to be as close as possible to the pressure switch for them to work properly um, so just want to do a different video for you out there regarding well tanks um you know there's all kinds of stuff out there um, how to size them, what manufacturer, um, what they're what they're constructed of. Uh, just want to do something a little bit different for you, but still hitting on the same topics, and that's uh, proper tank selection and proper tank sizing is the number one thing to uh, keep your pump from cycling too much, which is gonna also make your pump last a long time, so you don't have to buy another one. So. Uh, thanks for watching. Check us out on YouTube for more videos that are related to pumps, tanks. Uh, check us out at Wendell Well Services for some of the uh, products we offer as well. Thanks for watching.